Malcolm. My name is Hitachi, and this is your weekly update and patch patch notes with me. But this time, it's the big deals in free DLC. I read, you listen, I comment, you play, so you can keep yourself up to date without need to read the updates. I do it for you. So let's dive in, and here we go. So. It's Sengoku, uh, Sengoku patch notes. Previous seasonal patch notes have also. So uh, here's the tis. It's gonna come tomorrow, the first of June. Uh, new content events. We will be revealing our launch events in our Sengoku release uh, article. Stay tuned for the article uh, on June one. Doesn't three. New feature, Unit Mastery. Uh, we have been through this so before in the uh, previous uh, updates. So, Unit Mastery is a brand new unit growth system available alongside existing feature. A new unit, uh, a unit Mastery is uh, gradually unlocks as you level it up, enabling you to increase its attributes and alter units, skills, or mechanics. The first units to receive. Mastery are Pike Militia, Perfect Guards, Mace Sergeant, Palace Guards, Albadier Sergeant. So it's gonna look like this. Uh, this is just a good example on Perfect gu uh, Guards. Uh, Units Mastery Access. You can uh, access Unit Mastery when checking the details of a unit which has a Mastery available. The list above. Uh, Alterly. You can use the filter uh, in the top right of the barracks to quickly see which units mastery is available for. Units mastery will be available for uh, for level 36 or above of warlocks. Control of mastery. A mastery. To level up unit mastery to, uh, for infantry units, you will need to use scroll of mastery in both uncommon and rare uh, rarities. Which can be earned from TV move, Master Commander, Honor Store, Special Limit Time Emma. For Mace Sergeants, you will need to use a special ver version of the Scroll of Mastery, known as Scroll of Mastery Mace Power, which are available via the tutorial and the Honor Store. Units Mastery Levels Level up units, unlock more units, uh, more unit mastery level up for them to master there are eight mastery nodes per unit so mastery level is here one to eight and two star units requires level the first you need to be level 10 and then you have two and three on level two to 11 on 12 you have four at level 14 you have 15 and level 6 uh, 14 also and level 7 is 16 and last one is 18. It's same on 3 star units, on 4 star units you start at level 12, keep going, we have a double at level 14 and I think this is wrong, it should be a 16 here for level 4 and level 5 is 18, same with 6 and level 7 is 20 and 24 for the last one. Uh, the quantity of items uh, required to unlock each mastery nose also depends on the what as the units as stars here. So um, you need uh, for mastery one uncommon five st uh, of them or st uh, two stars. Three stars can need five and four stars need ten so it's double amount. And you getting on level two you need 10, 10, 20 on, uh, on level three 10, 15, 25 so this doesn't increase on level three but this oh, these two do. Level 4, uh, 15, 25, 40. So it's, it's 10, 5, 15. That's like, I would like put it 10, 20, 30, 40, maybe. Then you have rare. So you're gonna have 4, 8, and 10. And on level 6, you need 15 uh, uncommon. Same as level 4. Here you need 25, same as uh, level. Or, and here you need 40, let's say like level, level, level 4. Level 7 needs 20, 40, and 60. 
place with 20. And here you need rare, so you need 6, 12, and 20. So it's 10, it's here's 4 increase, here's 2 increase, so it's kind of like 2, 4, 10. New solo PvE mode, Mastery Commander. Mastery Commander access. Press J to access the match mesh menu and select Mastery Commander on the PvE battle. More information? Mastery Commander it's, it is comprised of, of two phases. Phase 1, occupy the supply point to start phase 2. So you need to like take the uh, supply. I did this in the preview event and it went smooth. Uh, def uh, phase 2, defeat the enemy's leader to win. You need to fight the kill the hero. Reward chances. You will receive one reward per day for, for winning Master Commander. You can accumulate across days. Uh, up to four times. Reward will no longer be obtained after the upper limit is exceeded. Example, this means that if you not play Master Commander on day 1, 2 or 3, you can complete it 4 times and receive it re uh, a reward for all 4 on day 4. Ok, you can read more about uh, Master Commander in our dedicated article, which uh, is this. This will be explaining the basic rules and I will link this in the description, you will have it. Uh, in the uh, new future, honor store, you can pure select the item for uh, honor in the honor store. Honor store access. The honor store will unlock once you your warlord reaches level 100. Navigate to the unit tree U to access the honor store. Honor store information. Purchase limits recently reset weekly. You can purchase the following uh, items from the honor store. Uncommon scroll of mastery, rare scroll of mastery, uncommon scroll of mastery, maze power, rare scrolls of mastery, maze power, and maze sergeants unlock token and maze sergeants protection doctrine. So I thought, I think I saw like it's limit to 5 1 on these two. And you can uh, exchange for 5 this to 1 this also. Uh, battle Pass. A new Battle Pass has been uh, added to the Seasonal menu, F5. This time the team around Legends Feudal uh, Japan. Uh, tier 1, Shadow of uh, Shadow Morai, looks like this. Tier 100, 100 Victorious Attire, looks like this. Seasonal Units and Unit Challenges. Three units have been added to the seasonal units and interface F5 you will be able to access them through the season. season. Units release dates. R uh, Ronin 3 stars June 1, that is tomorrow. Onamocha 4 stars June 12, which is means we're gonna start to be able to play tier 4 also. Orochi Samurai 5 stars June 26, this is when we're gonna start to be able to play uh, 5 stars also. The Naginagata monks three stars are also available from June 1 as part of the mercenary interface. Find out more about all of the units this season in our unit spotlight article. So we have a unit spotlight light article like this. I know we I did show this in um uh, in a, a, a video before, but I'm gonna link this in the description, including our upcoming four stars Asago. Uh, Ashari Guru Matlock unit, including, including, doesn't, oh it says here, about that, uh, unit, previous unlock requirement, unlocks, 3 stars, can I? Four stars, Omocha. Uh, four monsters, you must unlock a ruin, blah blah blah. Yeah, that's this. It's normal shit. Uh, unit challenge rewards. Your own unit challenge available June 1 after me. Uh, stage 1, three days running contract. Stage 2, running units. 
Phase 3 running exclusive doctrine uh, for S of the Avatar. It's kind of the same thing. This is contract, unit medals, unit, exclusive ep uh, epic doctrine, and avatar. And fifth, this, uh, the, the tier 5 tier uh, here is 3 days uh, doctrine rare one, and then units. Uh, medals and then you have the units permanently and then you have spirit and then you have the epic exclusive doctrine and then you have samurai avatar campaign the borderlands uh, is the core region of this season each of the house occupying a congress made has a chance to earn the title of hegemon so campaign stage is stage one then we have the first this tomorrow territory war takes place in the borderlands and Moria. And seize the season of seize seals, deploy units 1 to 3.5 stars. Armor says bonus inactive, crafting equipment bonus second inactive, and auxiliary pot 6. The 12th, uh, this second paid stage is uh, June 12th to tw June 25. And it's Borderland, Mayang, and Ostaria we're gonna be in. And then we deploy my units is. Uh, 1 to 4.5 stars and armor says bonus uh, active crafting equipment inactive and exilus point 6 stage 3 all in chaos the june 6 to uh, 26 to july 2016 it was placed in all these three areas and it's all units active uh, inactive and crafting equipment bonus still so it's just the unlock tier 5, that's the difference. Uh, stage 4, absorbs the throne, July 17 to July 30. It will take place in all this and you can take Maoyang capital and Dora capital. And then you have uh, all units and all bonus uh, is unlocked. And July 30 to August 13, you have Imperial Dawn when you can take. Borderland Capital Conquer City. And then you stage 6 is the end of it. Uh, uh, the season. Seasonal map. Uh, we will be releasing a brand new solo PvE map. Later in the season, there are small teaser. This looks like this. Oh, this is what we got a teaser about uh, when uh, there before and picture and stuff like that. Adjusted content. New player tutorial, we will update the tutorial, meaning the players who join at the launch of Sengu, they shouldn't get to experience different tutorials. I will uh, make a new character tomorrow or for this weekend and record it for you and you will see how it looks like. New player Sengu Q season, season, characters created after the Sengu season launch will no longer have access to Hero's Journey. Uh, instead, you will have uh, will be able to complete new main and side quests during new tutorial PV le levels. You will be able to access the new uh, progress pass, which include login rewards, drill master trial, and dry drill master rewards. By logging in each day, you will be able to earn all login rewards. Complete the drill master trials quest, you will be again pro progress on the drill master's rewards tracking. Uh, granting you loads of useful items. Newly created character will no longer get to choose a unit from the tutorial, but instead will unlock the maze garden by completing the new main quests. Both veterans and new players will be will in, fa in effect unlock the same number of units identical of rarity to the new and old tutorials. On Asian changes. We're removing the War School as quest, granting a four-star unit with the same Goku season. We have removed the uh, the previous tutorial sign in event. Okay. Uh, veteran players. Nothing will change in the terms of the tutorial for characters created before the same Goku season. Uh, you will still have access to the Heroes unit F4. You will be able to purchase the, uh, the four uh, three stars Mason um, Ace Mason from the owner store. Then we have ranked battles. Ranked battles will be starting on June two. 
we'll be adjusting the map pool for ranked battles or a couple weeks into this season stay tuned for the survey on official discord ranked will uh, be uh, continued to be played at the same times as the eternal season uh, you can check the events page in game for more information current map pool the following maps will be available part as a part of ranked uh, for the launch and thing you can pause the video you can read through it here and that's you see all the, the maps as mentioned here above we'll be running a survey shortly after the launch uh, of the season so just the map pool in our discord server Fame Store. Fame Store will reset and be, become available for season. Thank you. Fame Store offer offerings. So, uh, this will be kind of same thing. Uh, Battle per, uh, Hero, XP Core, Powder, Silver, Cisco, Rogue Armor, Death Process, Split Armor, Grill Master, Artificial Stone, Unus Matter, Artificial Stone, Lotus Water, Artificial Stone. Rare Doctrine Selecting Box, Rare Weapon Schematic, Rare Armor Schematic, Lotus Water, Tiercy, Artificial Stone, Epic, blah blah blah, Lingus Box, Tiercy, Azure Stag, Samurai, then Go Wind of Fury Titan. Internal Store starting from the Sengu Pisno Antique at uh, Attires teaming around the Helms Season Attire will be added to the store where they will receive a 20% blade discount paragons team and tweak our tires are no longer discounted and their cost reverted to the original price highlands teams heroes and units attires have been removed from the season door seasonal runes we have refreshed the seasonal runes in game part of the f5 new better customization we have added 15 new appearance simply use a disguise kit to change your up, uh, appearance with the new option. For players above level 40, you will be able to head to the Warden to receive a free disguise quick kit for the season launch. I will take a separate video for this for you guys, so you can see it. Deploy and defend. Increase the rewards of deploy and defense. Victory now grants 4 uncommon doctrine wisdom, previous 2 and 2 chest ra uh, of random wisdom this is one the daily loot cap for both uncommon doctrine wisdom and chest of random wisdom remains unchanged shared units uh, reset when sangri season launches shared units will be reset new units colors we added three new colors option for units in the settings units colors so you have red or girly and slate for my units ally units and enemy Balance and adjustment weapons. We have a reevaluated uh, the role of each weapon and made a serious changes. to the set effect of epic hero schematics. Three sets of effects remain unchanges. Uh, short sword and shield. Two sets effects. Iron side cooldown is reduced by two seconds. Four, se four sets effect. Iron side is no longer debuff, but instead replenish health over months over glaive improved the feel of the two first basic attacks and the timing of their hits enabling you to wave them more comfortably into other attacks and skills two sets effects warlords greetings colon is reduced by two seconds four sets uh, combats dismount grants crowd control immunity for two seconds Long sword and shield, two sets effect, Knight of Wolves colon is really increased by increased but three seconds. Why it's increased? This must be a typo. Must decreased or reduce it by three seconds. Four se uh, se uh, sets effect crowd control immunity during ultimate skill and uh, clash of shields duration extended by two seconds i think is that the rush uh, 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 ultimate polex two sets effects weapon dance damage and movement speed is reduced uh, are increased by 75 percent and that is of 25 percent so it's like 
75% as a fourth, three fourths of uh, 25%. So, is it four or five? No. Uh, six or something like that. So, it's like 19% or something. It's not something like. So, we end up on 43.5%. Four sets effects, crowd control, immunity, and for a 10% increase in health to ultimate skill. You're getting uh, crowd control immunity when you're using uh, your uh, ultimate. This is diffuse. Uh, Maul fixes the issue where combat dismount doesn't grant immunity to dazzle. Two sets effect mountain breaker uh, columns is reduced by two seconds. Four sets effect skills consume 20% less amino. Fear. Uh, two sets launch mars duration increase by four seconds four sets effects mounted a right click stamina cost reduced by 15 percent does she two sets effects bloodbath duration increased by two seconds and four sets effects crowd control immunity during combo strike combo strikes basic attacks inflict special effects that's like a permanent crowd control if you keep hitting Pike, two sets effects. Swift like the wind, strong as a storm, shock attack, and immovable as a mountain. Duration increased by one. Four sets effects. Cold dragon and green dragons cooldown reduced by one second for each and hit up to maximum of six seconds. Musket, two sets effect. Black powder grenades cooldown is reduced by three seconds. That's the ultimate. 4 seconds uh, effect, deploy and caltrops uh, quantity plus 2. I don't know what this is, uh, if it's stronger or something. Bow, new weapon feature, armor penetration against units increased by 36%, but reduced by 36 against other targets. Flaming arrow, cooldowns uh, increased to 15 seconds, was 12 seconds. The speed spread slightly increased. Two sets effects, marksman's duration increased by one second. Four sets effects, basic attacks damage increased by 25% and armor pen. Short bow, two sets effect, duration of poison and bleed from skills increased by one second. Four sets effects damage interval of poison and bleed from skills reduced by 0.2 seconds. This is gonna bleed faster. Dual blades. Two sets effects. Alchemy, wipers and hide grants invulnerability for 0.4 seconds. Four sex sets effects. Killing heroes resets the cooldown of all skills except for your paragon skill. Reduce the cooldown of Infinator 30 seconds. But wouldn't that say resets all skills? Wouldn't that also be that? Confused. Then it says 30 seconds. Okay. Chain Dart and Skimitar. Two sets effects. Trap Praise. Cooldown is reduced by 3 seconds. Four sets effects is Sting Strikes. Target quantity. One. I don't know what they mean with it like that or if it's a typo. So that's all the patch notes. And uh, so that's include uh, I I'm really looking forward for this season because we're gonna have uh, a lot and uh, there's gonna be a lot of changes and it's probably coming more and we will have six units to look forward in this time and some new tutorials. So I will popping videos for you. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like, and comment, and hit the notification button. And thank you for watching, and see you next time. Bye bye.